Before the tour, I'd like to give a word from our sponsor, Tool Rocket PDF Converter. This PDF converter is a professional PDF file converter app which is available both in iOS and Android, which means you can install it on your iPhones, iPads, or Android phones or tablets. It is a multifunctional app which allows you to convert PDF from or to different file types like Word, Excel, PNG, JPEG, or text. It also merges or splits or reads PDF documents. What I love about this software is the picture to PDF function. Basically, all the images that you captured on your phone can be converted into one PDF file. It comes very handy, especially for students, now that all submissions are being done online. So you could just take a photo of your quiz or exams and it converts all of them into one PDF file. You can also merge different PDF files using the PDF Merge or split a PDF file into several files using the PDF Split. I'll link all the download links in my description box so you can easily find it. Also, the first 10 people to comment why this app would be useful for them will get a free premium subscription from our sponsor. Back to the video! So upon entering, you'll see four sets of tables. 
Although I don't think I'm going to allow dine-in until there's vaccine already for the coronavirus. And then upon entering, you will see this hanging shelf. This is not the final design yet. I don't have that much stuff to use to decorate. So let's just leave this as that for now. And then beside that hanging shelf is this wall. I really love this accent wall and okay wait I'm going to give you a good um, <laughs> angle for this one so I plan on making this as the wall where they can put their drinks and take a photo so on top it has that vine and then it has lights at the back and then here you're going to see different kinds of moods but whatever it is that you're feeling right now I think the answer would be to get a milk tea and it's something that's very comforting and that's what I want you to feel every time you step out of the shop so what I will recommend for my customers is for them to write their mood there and then place their drink there and then take a photo of their drink So yeah, below that is an air purifier. So I got this from Shopee for only 2,000 pesos and it already has UV light and HEPA filter. Um, from what I've read and from what I heard from other people, they're saying that HEPA filter is very important for an air purifier because it's the filter that can filter viruses and bacteria. So, although I'm not yet going to allow dine-in for the meantime, I think it's still safe for me to have this air purifier so that those who are waiting for their orders, although I would still require them to wear a face mask, um, the air would still be purified and, you know, better be safe than sorry. So, moving on, Beside this accent wall is another hanging shelf, although I haven't decorated it yet. I don't have that much things to put or to hang, so what I have there are, you know, that baby elephant that I've painted in my previous vlog. So I'm going to design it. Um, some other time hopefully before the opening but I doubt I can do it but anyway so moving on on the other side of this shop before we proceed to the counter I have these three frames showing the anatomy of the things that I'm selling my shop is offering three kinds of drink so I have the cheese cloud I have the Milk Tea Classic and I have the Milk Tea Premium. So this is where they're going to see what's the composition of their drink so that they would know what to order. I think this one is very important especially if you have a lot of things in your menu. It's easier for your customers to know what drink they're going to order if they know what's inside their drink. So on top of that is a shelf and then I just put fake grass, fake leaves. Yeah, I really like that part of the wall also and it made the wall um, look a little classy and not so bare. So yeah. And then let's move on to the counter area. So on the counter area, first you will see this counter. I got it from Facebook Marketplace and it's very nice because it's already laminated. And I think it really fits the theme of my shop. And then I just had this Sintra board printed. I'm going to link the link of the shop below. Yeah. And then on the left side, we have this um, fake grass and then alcohol for my customers and hello from Miku. <laughs> so this is the 
part where they will order and they will get their drinks. That's why I placed my alcohol here. So, ah, yeah. Okay. And then above this counter is for R2 pendant lamps. I got this from Lazada for I think 400 pesos or 300 more or less. And if you remember this lamp, this is the lamp that I was supposed to paint in white or gold I think. But then it turned out that um, it matches the theme more because I have some other stuff that are black. It complemented the vibe of the shop and my door is brown or dark brown. So yeah, I think it matches the overall look of my shop. Okay, so inside the counter, let's do a counter raid. <laughs> so inside the counter first, You'll see all these containers. This is where I will put all the things that I will put in the milk tea premium. And then this is where the pearls are going to be put. So for the black pearl and then for the white pearl. And then alcohol for the cashier which is me. <laughs> and then calculator of course so that we'll be able to compute correctly. And then these are the loyalty cards that I did before. So, and then cup lids. This is the cup lid. And then the straw. And then behind it is our Wi Fi. And then here are the cups uh, 22 owns, 16 owns. We only offer two sizes. This one's the regular, and this one's the large. So, yeah. And then behind that is the counter or the working area. <laughs> so here first you will see the ceiling machine. So this is going to be used for Milk Tea Classic and Milk Tea Premium. But for Cheese Cloud, we're going to use the cup lids. And then on the first layer, we have all the syrups that we're going to use for our drinks. So here is the Nutella, vanilla, caramel, hazelnut, brown sugar, winter melon, sugar syrup. And then here's the creamer because this is the most used powder. And usually this comes after the tea, which is this one. So this is our tea barrel. This one will house black tea. And then on top of that will be my powders. So these are the powder con containers for my drinks. And then beside that is the water dispenser for whenever a customer asks for a glass of water. And then on top is the menu. So there's the menu. Yeah, so our Milk Tea Classic is very affordable. It ranges from 69 pesos to 99 pesos. And then for our Milk Tea Premium, it's from 99 pesos to 129 pesos. But it's already fully loaded, so I would really suggest you get our Milk Tea Premium. My favorite for that would be the Winter Melon Cheesecake and the Oreo Supreme Puff Cream. Yeah, that's my personal favorite. For the Milk Tea Classic, of course, my favorite is Winter Melon Milk Tea. And then for our Cheese Cloud series, we have two variants. We have the tea-based and we have the milk-based. For the tea-based, my favorite would be the Nutella Overload. And then for the milk base, my favorite is Signature Ube. And then my parents are cooking the snacks. So we have baked macaroni, carbonara, chicken wings, burger, and cheesy beef nachos. So moving on, here is our sink. 
and then this is also the working area so this is where they're going to prepare the milk tea before they put it in the glass and then after preparing glass will be here and then they will place the pearl the add-ons and serve it to the customer okay. finally this is the wash area hello there <laughs> So this is the wash area. I was really confused as to how I'm supposed to do the layout for this. So again, this is not the final layout, but for now, I think this will suffice. But you know how fickle I am. So I'm sure in just a month or two, the design of this would change or maybe next week. <laughs> Who knows? So this is the sink. This third this is where they're going to wash their hands. So we have the faucet and then we have the hand soap. And then we have the mirror na hindi pa nalilinis. <laughs> and then we have some decorations here. And over here is the washroom na sobrang dumi pa because they're still working on the tiles. But I'm just going to show you a glimpse of how the bathroom looks like. Pero yeah, sobrang dumi pa niya. But tiles siya from floor to ceiling. And then we have that light and exhaust fan. So yeah. So that's it for this vlog. I hope that you enjoyed this little tour around my small milk tea shop if you're curious this is located in Pantubig, San Rafael, Bulacan hopefully we'll be able to branch out in Metro Manila in the future maybe after the bar but for now um, you guys know how much effort I put into building this from scratch and I hope that you support my small business just maybe by liking or sharing my posts on our Facebook and Instagram page at miku.pbar. Thank you for watching and I'll see you on my next vlog which is my first day or the opening of this shop. I'm very excited and kind of scared because you know before I was only running a restaurant in Diner Dash and now I'm running my own legit restaurant, shop, cafe, whatever you call it. Ah, it's so overwhelming but I'm very happy because I'm finally making my dream come true. Thank you so much. See you on my next vlog. Bye!